All right, so let's talk about uh, getting incorporated with the quarterback you guys had last year offense. At least has that returned to you guys. Uh, it's going pretty good. Um, we're getting better with the offense and more plays that uh, the coach are putting in. So we're just practicing hard and getting ready for the game right now. Is it a good thing that you guys are starting off with a team like Colin right off the bat? Uh, I mean, we just practicing real hard, just taking the game well, week by week. So it don't matter who we play, we just go play into the best side of the team. Sounds like Coach Tanner was mentioning that you guys are sort of like the foundation of this year's team. What, what's that like? Um, it just shows how much he has, you know, that that meaning in the, in the team. So he feels that we have to put the team on the back and like lead them in. So I feel like that we have to step up and just be that leader for him and you know, that run his team. You're part of that linebacker core that he coaches. <laughs> I mean, you're going to be one of those big leaders this year. What, what does it take to, to be a leader of this team this season? Um, just stepping up, you know, whenever, you know, if play, players down, you see that like we're going down. We just got to step up and just be that guy and say, hey, let's get back in and we're not done yet. You know, if we're still here, you know, always have to have that fight no matter what, no matter what happens. You guys start the season with a top 10 team yeah. at home. What, what's that like to have a kind of team like that first game right off the bat? It's just another challenge we have to, you know, just have to accomplish. I mean, everybody got big challenges in their lives. It's just, it's just one that just got to happen. It's always going to come. So we always got to step up and just be the better man to get in. How excited you to crank up this uh, sophomore year and get things going? I'm really excited. I feel that we got a good team this year. More competitive than we were last year. I'm just ready to get it on. You have kind of two double motivation here. One, help the team get them in the playoffs and get yourself onto a, a four-year school. So how much does that play into to your, how you're going to play? I just think the coach will give me opportunity to start here, be a leader of this team. Man. I, just, I, can, I just feel like they can guide my seats at another university. You're one of the few returning quarterbacks in Mississippi in junior college. So you got the experience under your belt. How are you going to help this team make sure you do get back to the postseason? You know, try to be the best leader I can be. Guide the team, put on my back, and be here when they need me. You guys start the season with a top 10 team right off the bat at home. What's what's that like to have that big test first game already? He's going to come out and play hard. Grant, what's the best part about this offense going into the season, if you like? Well, I know Quadre, he's back, so he has a lot of experience with uh, with some of the receivers we have. and um, We've uh, bonded from receivers. We've got a bunch of young guys, but they started from camp and they've came a long way and they're we're rolling I think so and uh, we're doing a great job bonding together getting to know each other getting to know Quadre and the running backs and I think I think we'll we'll do pretty good. You guys feel like you're being maybe underrated this year with with how much you have coming back especially on defense this season? Um, I wouldn't say underrated people just don't look at us as a big time but but we like that we like being the underdog and uh, we get more chip on our shoulder when we come out every game and give it our all and get those get those wins if we can. You'll be an underdog the first week next Thursday against a top ten opponent. Just talk about starting the season like that right off the bat. A tough game, but uh, I know we're prepared. We're prepared uh, mentally and physically. Coaches have pushed us uh, all week and uh, given us given us their all, and we give them our all, and we they know we're ready and we'll be ready when the game comes. Y'all have a returning quarterback this year, uh, one of the few teams in Juba that has that. What, what's it like to have an experience returning to you guys? It's great to have a returning signal caller because as an O-lineman, we got really used to him last year, was able to get, you know, kind of the groove of everything. Now that he's coming back, I think we can build more on that. And we'll be able to kind of go faster this year like we like to do. You guys feel like you're, you're sort of flying under the radar a little bit? Not many people know the kind of potential you guys have? I think, yeah, we just were – we're not as young as we were last year, and I believe we've got a lot of returning sophomores that really, we've not got a lot of attention, but I believe that this year we're really going to step out and become a great team. Yeah, you're part of this offense that's, we've got a returning quarterback this season. What's it like to have that experience coming back to you guys? Oh man, it's, it's a great experience. Um, we got a great quarterback coming back, quite a great. <laughs> feel comfortable with him back there. He's a great playmaker also, make everybody mind him great. Uh, for the experience coming back with the outfit, man, it feel good to have the explosion and the experience behind us. I feel like we're doing a lot of great things this year. You like having a top 10 team first game? Yes, I love it. I love it. Ain't no mistakes can be made for a game. I love it. And what kind of, it sounds like you guys are 
sort of being undersold this year. You guys got a lot of potential. Yeah. Is there a reason why everyone's overlooking? I don't see why. Maybe because of how we finished last season. But it's a whole new season. Break very much harder. I say multiple times harder than we did last season. And I'm needing to make that thing happen. Uh, defense has got a lot of returning starters this year. You guys are sort of going to be back over this year's team. What's that like? <laughs> It's a great experience, you know, to have a lot of sophomores coming back at the defense back position, you know. So I feel pretty strong that we uh, play great, you know. And with that defense, you guys are sort of going to be counted on this year, maybe with the offense just starting off. You have a top 10 team at home to begin the season. How do you guys going to make sure you come out of the world? You know, we like the challenge, you know, since it's a lot of hype around the game, but we're just going to come out and play our hardest. Mm -hmm. Michael, you're, you're part of the defense. It's got a lot of guys coming back this season. What, what's it like to be a part of that kind of experience? It's great, man. It's great. You know, it's like the team counts on us, and uh, we're gonna lead. We're gonna we're gonna step up. You guys start with top ten team at home right off the bat to begin the season. What is it like to have a big test that first week? It's a great challenge. It's a great challenge, but we're ready for it. We've been working hard, and uh, we're ready for it. Mars, the best part about this team this season, you feel like? Man, it's we came here as freshmen, we're going to grow up and blend together. Everybody working hard, everybody home, ready to get this win. You guys seem like you got, you, you know, you mentioned that close bond with the team, but it seems like no one's really talking about you guys this season. You sort of, you like being underrated? Yeah. Uh, we'll deal with it. We're going to take care of it. <laughs> we're going to handle it. <laughs> and that, that first week, you guys started with a top 10 team. What's it like to go against a team right off the bat that's that great time? Are we excited about the ten? We ready for it. Can't wait to step up on the field on the next day. All right, Trav, what, what's the best part about the offense for you guys this season? Uh, we got some good good players coming in, good backs. And we experienced some receiver spots, so it should be pretty good. You guys feel like you're maybe not being talked about as much as you should going into the season, especially with all the guys you have returning? Uh, we don't pay much attention to the, to the top. We just work hard every day, try to do the best we can be. How excited are you to get the season started against a top 10 opponent at home and maybe make an early statement? I'm oh, just going to go out and play our best. Whatever happens, happens. Just leave it out on the field. Darius, you got a lot of coming back on defense this year. You're going to be a big part of that. What's it like to be on a defense with that much experience returning? I'm going to feel great. It's feel great that, you know, we brought a lot back, even though we too many teams then. You guys are going to have to stop some people this year, maybe early on because of the offense, you know, maybe coming up. Or I guess how much of a responsibility you guys have to make sure you go out and help this team win games? I mean, it's a big responsibility because, you know, we, we brought back our defense, you know. Our defense, we, we, we turn our defense on our back, you know, so we expect it. You go up against a pretty big offensive line that first week against Cole Lynn. What, I guess, what do you need to do to make sure you guys bring it home and get a win? We, as we just, you know, need to just keep doing what we're doing, working hard at practice, you know, just preparing for them guys.